There are many prayers that are very powerful. Well, how come it doesn't become that when you do it, it doesn't seem to be powerful? The reason is because you did not uh, cultivate uh, renunciation. This is a some. This is a very very important point because if one does not cultivate renunciation, you cannot gain. We cannot gain. So, <coughs> uh, the best example, uh, the best example is uh, with renunciation. Uh, for example, uh, if we ourselves hold on to our nature and form and function so tightly, then we can never evolve to become something that is a more useful and more beneficial for others. Because it, anything that is out of our comfort zone equates to pain, equates to suffering, and equates to something that we, will not, we don't and will not like. So, nature, form, function would be very similar uh, we will think a very good example of iron ore. If we go out in the wild and we find uh, iron ore, uh, then it appears just like dark brown rocks. Ordinarily, maybe for us, it's almost impossible to recognize. But those people who are, those people who are skilled, having that capability they do they will know that this is an iron ore right in terms of that understanding if we ourselves stubbornly hold on to nature form function as an iron ore then we will not be able to be of a greater service to others, we will not be able to first get crushed to become pe to to become uh, like a almost sand like, and then after that uh, to be cooked, to be to be smelted down, have the sand the remove the top layer removed, and then the the iron at the bottom, the molten iron at the bottom, even as a molten iron at the bottom. Uh, even as that, <coughs> once it is cooled, we become uh, raw iron, <coughs> cast iron. And then after that, again, when we become like cast iron, we again become very stubborn to maintain the nature form function aspect as a cast iron cast iron block cast iron piece right? and if we do not renounce the next stage of evolution cannot come in that means again to becomes to be smelted okay and then to be made into usable wares for example some use a cast iron cooking pan some uh, it becomes uh, it mixed with uh, carbon uh, then after re repetitive beating, it becomes steel. And with some other ingredients added inside, it becomes stainless steel. Right? So, the more one gives up its our own nature identity, the more we are willing to do that, the greater we are able to benefit, to be receive benefit and to be of benefit for others.